Hello, everyone. Uh, today is my last full day in England, and I had to show you some things before I go because I need to throw them away because my parents seem to keep lots of things from when I'm a child. Um, so this is kind of a hybrid video. It's kind of like a, a blast from the past style, kind of like the baby photos I did. Essentially, there's the the, the tag thirty things that I, that I find in my bedroom. This is going to be not necessarily thirty things. It might be more. Might be less. I'm not going to differentiate. Uh, but this is some things, lots of things, many things, mainly a certain type of thing, uh, that I would have had in my room, and some things that are still here today, which are embarrassing. Um, yeah, let's have a look. Boom. Right there. It's Mickey Mouse. Non-toxic. Crayons. Oh, brilliant, I didn't even see that. These crayons belong to Matthew Fro. Right there, I don't even see that. So I guess I was a fan of what well, I still am a fan of Disney. Anyway, uh, that's one thing. VHS. You gotta love a bit of VHS, Parsley the Lion, if you've, if you've never seen it, it's amazing. I used to watch Sesame Street and Parsley the Lion herbs um, back to back when I was a kid. And along with that, one of my favourite movies of all time, um, Hook. Such a good movie. From VHS to CD, The Legend of Zelda Melodies of Time. So this has like a bunch of original Zelda music. Massive nerd. This is what I actually found in my room, and uh, not the stuff that I found at storage. This is this is just stuff I have uh, around that my mum kept to flavour my room. I guess I don't know. This is a dog puppet. You can wave at you. Also, this is I think since I was like one year old. This is a little penguin. It's sweet still. <laughs> so I'm impressed that that still works. Not my dog's never ate it. So but yeah, this is a little kitty cat, beanie baby. That's also in my room. Along with lots more up there, which I'm not going to get involved with. Can you want some candy? Some candy? Yeah, some candy. So go, ah! Snake. Just the oldest trick in the book. More of my nerddom. Uh, this is a starter deck of Yu-Gi-Oh. It's a shiny blue eyes white dragon. It's in pretty good condition, actually. <laughs> it's called. It's called Lord of D. Spellcaster Shiny Lord of the D. You do what you want, Mr. Lord. It's your prerogative. Ah. Yes. Uh, Beano. Love it. Brilliant. Classic comic. Every Thursday. November the 2nd, 1996. Wow. Dennis the Menace. Oh, this is what Dennis the Menace looks like in England, by the way. He's not a little blonde head kid with a catapult. He still has a catapult. But, um, yeah, this was, he was a comic. He was part of a comic in the Beano. Okay, this is this is the what was in my room then. This was actually what my room would have looked like many, many years ago. And, as my wife kindly says it, it is a miracle that I did not turn out gay. There's a, you'll think there's a theme. You'll realise there's a theme. Okay, so this is no, uh, this is this is not as embarrassing. I like these. These are still kind of cute. Hundred and one Dalmatians posters, reversible, no less. One. So I like dogs. This was before I was allowed a dog as a child. Um, so I think I just plastered my wall with with dogs. And one of them. You can see. We got one more Dalmatians one. Or it gets a little weird. I'm sorry to put you through this, but I think you'll enjoy it. We start <laughs> good with um, hot posters, Spice Girls hot posters, and I have a lot of them. And this is where we start to see a theme. That is Victoria Beckham, or Posh Spice, formerly known as Sporty Spice, Baby Spice. 1997, The Spice Girls. Yay! Spice Girls. A poster? Yep. Oh god, there's more Spice Girls and more Spice Girls. And my god, if it weren't more Spice Girls. Oh, it's legs right now. Apparently, I like to enjoy back. Oh no, two of them. Yep. More Spice Girls. A little bit more Posh Spice. Hopefully. Sorry, David, but I hung your wife on a wall. Not in a creepy way. Like a teenage way. Oh, there's no way out then. Oh, God. The Ultimate Spice Girls. 
and then there's a poster on the other side. This is just horrible. Oh, here's something nicer. Disney and me. Oh, that's better. Oh, well, that, that's alright. I did like Michael Jackson as well. But I may have taken that for the boy zone collection, maybe? Oh, no. Both wrong. Absolutely. Michael Jackson was a uh, high hopes. Boyzone took it down a notch. And then it landed absolutely back at the Spice Girls collection. Of course. That's terrifying. Jesus! Scary Clown! I was a Sonic fan as well. And also, just to top it all off, most importantly, um, there were lots of Spice Girls posters that I had in my That was essentially the message of this video. Um, and then there's just a lovely Pete's private tour. I question my youth. Alright guys, thanks for watching. I uh, appreciate it. I hope you had fun. I had fun going down memory lane. Uh, and if you did have fun, please give me a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button. And yeah, then I can keep making these silly little things. Uh, and entertain you on the tinternets. So yes, until next time, see you later.